My name is Lindsay Sierka. I'm a student at the Frank H. Nutter MD School of Medicine. My capstone project is looking at outcomes for patients who are undergoing a new surgical procedure as a treatment for atrial fibrillation. I got involved with the project by finding one of the physicians who worked at our clinical affiliate, St. Vincent's Medical Center, and I was able to talk to them about what their scholarly interests were. So I found a physician, Dr. Joseph Tiano, who was willing to work with me, and together we developed this project in order to follow up on the surgical procedure that he himself is doing. Lindsay's been an integral part into organization with this large database. We have a lot of patients. She helped me design the protocol. We submit to an IRB, and then we review the data, and she's been maintaining that. And then we've been lucky enough to write these results up recently, so she's had the opportunity to see it from the beginning to the end. We monitor the patients and collect data before their procedure, see how it goes during the procedure, and then follow them up for outcomes to see if we can successfully prevent these patients from going back into atrial fibrillation. She's traveled with me recently to the conference in American Heart Association that we presented. We were able to take what we learned from the project, put it into a poster, and meet with different people throughout the medical field and show them what we're learning and the results that we have from our study. Working with Lindsay has been a tremendous experience, for, I feel, for the both of us. This capstone project sets Quinnipiac University apart by allowing students an opportunity right from their first year to get out there and work with a physician that they want to work with to investigate areas that they're interested in and to drive their own learning. It's allowed me to see cardiology in a different light. I've been able to work directly in the operating room and to see outside of a textbook what actual disease processes look like and how to treat patients. And it's brought a first-hand context to the things that we're learning about in school, which I think is an invaluable experience.